I am now a coach on Medify. If you'd like me to help you pick up our improving competitive ultimate, you can book a lesson with me by clicking the link in the description. So for today's video, we'll be looking at DeBuzz's run at Smash Factor 9, where he played mostly Rosalina. If you like videos like this, make sure to like the video and subscribe. It really does help me out a lot. Also drop a comment telling me why you think there aren't more Rosalinas in competitive play. But yeah, let's get into the video. DeBuzz has the best one of the, those things, whatever you call them. His is the best. You can't tell me otherwise. No joke. Like 20 or, or even 30. <laughs> Alright, anyways, anyways. With the alarm, with oh the my gun. key! And look at that Went so deep. Go. Like two characters on the same, uh, on the same side. Uh, watching with very careful those Luma. I'm surprised we're not seeing any like revenge coming out uh, from Sky J. Well, like when he's, while he's getting juggled by the buzz. Dude, that he did the thing again! I'm gonna call that like the wave shine up smash. Because he's directional air dodging. Now the Luma trying to make safe. The recovery for Rosalina. Look at the spacing. Ooh, that, that was a really good fair. The wave star, I like that. The way that the butt, that instant that Sky J actually took the stock off of the butt is something. That yeah, you gotta respect Luma. Like all that happened to Sky J because he got hit and then he tried to do something and then he chilled, chilled. But no, Sky J actually focused on Rosalina, which is very, very good for him oh. in that in that situation right here. Surviving three up. I need Sky J to not two, three up try to revenge and now in those spots. That rage on Incineroar, you add that to a revenge. Revenge? Oh no, air dodge. Oh, there's a revenge. And he gets punished. That was weird. I think he got punished because he re he revenged Luma's attack and not uh, Rosalina's. Okay, there it is. That's what I was expecting more of. Luma has a shield, also as a weapon. Like, Incineroar parried that Luma in Russian, but already was Rosalina there. Dude, the buzz is not letting him land. Jesus. Now, showing glasses. Because this guy also loves to show us protecting, uh, respecting that Luma. And she is that's it. Here, and that's gonna be yeah. enough. All right, the buzz takes game one pretty handily. Pretty much what I expected. Like this matchup just seems like it would be rougher in Cinderor. What's up, Tilde? Also good yesterday, bro. Um. But yeah, why do you pick? Li I oh, I think he picked Lilac because of the slants. They actually help Incineroar with two framing. That's my guess. Let's go ahead and see how exactly this is gonna help him. There's no way. There's oh, no he way. blew he up. Jeez. Under her dress and the range that extra range that Luma gives, making Another a lot one. of uh, difficult time to Sky to get in. But look at this. The stage. This oh, he's dead. I think. The, no. Jeez, this is at 59. Oh, almost a three stock here. What's gonna be the response from the boss? But we are seeing okay, the that. that. Reversal. Lila, like, yeah. <laughs> Immediately, like, frame one, he's banning Lila because what a conversion that we're seeing right here from Sky. All right. The buzz doing what he did first, first, first game, though, just juggling the hell out of him. Extra work right here, you know, doing a little bit of, of extra. So close. To, to making sure that. Oh, that was good. As hurt as okay, this. He's the one that has to play catch up on this occasion. This is. Um, ooh, exactly this is a really good spot for Sky J. An incorrect option right there in regards to the neutral being. Now we're. That Sky J seems to be a bit yeah, the buzz is catching on to like how Sky J wants to side side beam. Sky J is getting like a little bit too greedy with like uh his side beams. Yeah, see, look, he like he wants to side beam way too much. Kalsos lost to Lawn winners and Siski and losers. Mr. R lost to Sun Dare. I always. Get oh, he might be dead here. Good recovery. Okay, all Sky needs is a grab. He literally just needs a grab. That's our backer, that's it. Yeah, the buzz kind of bet it all on that. Late hit in which he throws him up. Yeah, and also, I mean, we've, we've seen two games already with a lot of juggles from Rosalina making so hard to... It's crazy how well the buzz plays around revenge. Like... To reset those Even though Sky is getting these revenge, so yeah, he oh, he, he can't land. <laughs> he just can't land. But even though Sky is getting revenge, he's not getting that much off of it. Sky is also getting really greedy with like how oh, he's getting really greedy with like these side beams too. Oh, the Luma took the hit. People being very impatient and whenever they're yeah. whenever they're you know they're oh my that was they, nuts that, that was exactly so good nine percent on the board we're already That's seeing sky jay within his last stock dude he like That's okay like crazy. he can't how many times it, like he's getting his revenge like he's getting revenge but he's not getting anything off of it white numbers on that percentage look at the interaction that was so smart oh my god dude this is disgusting 
trying to go for against that. That was, no, dude, that was a body bag. He did 17%. Sky J's got a clutch, bro. No, he got smacked. You changed on real quick, Tilde. I thought you said, I thought you said Sky J was going to clutch. <laughs> Do I think Rosa should be buffed? Oh, okay, I, no. I mentioned this earlier. I think Rosalina is potentially going to be a top, is a top tier character with like all the tech she has and like the tech that is yet to be discovered. Here uh, in the small battlefield, almost getting it a little bit far from him. Now Sky J. Yeah, that, 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 that was disgusting. I don't. Th I, I think Sky J was legit locked in shield with that directional air dodge. Oh, he's going. Oh my, he, he might be dead. You have to respect Luma. And now Sky with the upbeat. That's gonna be a what? I mean, someone did die, but I not who I expected. It was actually Sky J. He thought that okay, at least if I'm taking, if I'm going down, I'm taking you down with me. You know what? Double KO right there. But no, not at all. And now no opportunity in, in this. Sky J was slightly off. He could have gotten the kill because he's he was trying to grab him. It's gonna be a lot of damage. Yep. Wait, question: Have Lutini and the Buzz ever played? You know. This is looking like I literally don't remember. Oh no, they have, they have, they have, they have. They play a main stage. Yeah, yeah. That's right, Omar. And oh, they play a pound as well. Okay. Yeah, okay, gonna kill. And yeah, the boss. He knows. He knows he's on. Uh, on the okay. The buzz is in the camp. Oh, never mind. But now we don't have I assume he's just going to camp just because he doesn't want that to happen. Now he's at 42%. Damage for him, not quite enough. Again, big damage. No, he's zero. A little bit slow for the for the punish there. And you see, this is exactly what Skyjay needs to do. Oh, wait a minute. Whenever he, he's in the advantage, it's when Luma's not there. Whenever Luma doesn't have the opportunity to be on That was so close to connecting. Uh, it's gone. Oh, you know, is he? Gone. He's gonna going to lose. Yeah, if, this, if that was town, he was dead. And then Luma should be back at any moment. Yes, we have the occasion. And now, okay, okay, Luma, Luma's wow. just continuing right there. Continuing to spin. Yeah, he's, he's getting so green with these side beams. Good recovery. But now we're going once again. It seems like in the, right now Sky J is struggling quite a lot. The both with the hefty advantage state. This might be really it. One straight interaction. Oh no, he makes it. Again, yeah, but one again, one two one greedy with the side bees. The bus takes it. I feel like minus game three, it actually wasn't that bad. I think Sky J just needed to relax on the side bees. Sky J needed to kill Luma more. That too, but I feel like he did an okay job at killing Luma. I think more than anything, he needed to relax on the side bees usage. I feel like he's gonna go Omar. I feel like that's typically what DeBuzz would do against Europeans, because Europeans aren't as familiar against Omar. Because for whatever reason, no one in Europe plays Omar at a top level, or even a high level, it seems like. Oh, he's going Rosa. DeBuzz is a Rosa believer. I mean, some of the stuff he's been doing with Rosa is nuts. I understand why he's confident. Like, Rosa looks kind of dumb, honestly. When you can do all the all the Luma tech, it looks ridiculous. in fact, do in fact have gluttony and buzz here on oh they, yeah they're, they're playing neutral the stage pick wasn't <laughs> they are playing neutral i feel like their set is going to start slow but then i think it's going to pick up pace like near the middle they're going to be a bit more aggressive and then just start cashing out on leads really trap his landing he doesn't send like too far up and then really sets up looting to uh for a reset that's a confirm nair and up air kills Speaking of WAP, it is WAP time. It is online. We see him blinking like an old arcade. Oh, villain. what? Whoa, he's still so alive. Wow. Oh, he's dead. He's dead, right? Oh, he can live that. Okay. Now he's dead. The Buzz got so many chances to live that stock. He got so many chances. Looking for it. You saw the clap. Unfortunately, with Perwani and the Buzz hanging on to his second stock. For that stock to evaporate at 9%, that would have been really difficult, really unfortunate for the buzz. Yes, but I'm gonna get a walk kill here. Still cannot quite okay, he's dead. Job, but he does sell on the Luma, so getting that out of there, of course, will let you... That was really good from the buzz. Uh, I, I definitely thought he was gonna go, like, full left, too. Uh, he isn't able to actually, like, approach the buzz because this Luma just continues nice. to approach. Nice. It is the big buff Luma. He's fighting for for uh, for his princess. Another another Nair upper kill. Okay. Do, uh, Bluto got the weak hit of dash tech, so that's why he didn't kill. Good tech. How did, he, how did the buzz escape the down air? He was so ready to use a B. Like we didn't even see the buzz fall underneath Bluto. Ooh, that was. I'm surprised the buzz up smash there. Like he kind of autopiloted that option. 
through. Very oh no. Oh. Okay. Luma saving, saving the buzz. This star is the best party guard I've ever okay, seen. It should be a lot of damage. Yep. Oh, getting hit with a double rapid jab to attack on That was really lucky. Oh, that's it. Oh, there it is! The up air to okay. And the pop off from Glutiny. You can tell he really wants to be the buzz. His side flanking again, but this time Glutiny is the one who didn't get a hit. He neutralizes the Luma. Oh, okay, so we're actually seeing the platforms be hit there from the buzz. That is the can opener if I've ever seen one. Pretty much. <laughs> the bike, the bike ruining that punish from uh, the buzz. Uh, nared, uh, as an approach, but really only Ooh, one, but he lived that? Wow. Again, both these players still living at these like insane, at these high percents. Both looking very red. And both of them also on the first of getting out. Got to look both hits of, of down smash too, like the Rose and Luma hit. It seems like Luma in this matchup is very annoying. Not just because Luma does, you know, what, what he does, but like, it just seems like uh, there's moments where Gluten will drop a combo because uh, Luma extended the animation of his hit. <laughs> the buzz got one sock left. I mean, one of his socks are definitely going to be claimed by Waft. He has to be careful. Yeah, and see, look, that was the opportunity. Like, let's get rid of the. Let's get rid of the. Oh my right god, here. he could not land. What is a good stage for Rosalina? Clearly, Battlefield, because that is where the buzz counter pick. For Gudo, not able to get the up air conversion to buzz escapes. And here we go again, the dash attack from down tilt. And dead. after that red star out of here, let's see what RNG is. Buzz recover that way, kind of stall out for Luma. The buzz seems to be first focused on getting this return. Oh, he's dead. Wow. Yeah, he just hit, hung on for way too long. Just the bodyguards that appear for the buzz, they're just too strong. You have to respect them. Okay, there's the Nair. Gets the oh, oh, that was it. But unable to convert. There's the up there. We're chasing. Ludo is chasing so far high up. Dude, out of nowhere, nowhere so like, Luto just, like, snowballed this stock. But he has to close out, because, like, he actually dropped a confirm. Like, Luto could have locked it. Earlier, earlier. Not quite yet. Not even a, uh, a Kyo screen of that. Yeah. Okay. Here we can see the bike set up. Gonna apply pressure. Trying to get the re grab. Is that gonna be a push? Oh, oh, he oh, went for a hell Mary walk. The buzz. You're, you're a puppeteer master. Okay. And the buzz gets an out. I think. I think if Gluto. I think Gluto would have died if Luma also attacked with the. With the up smash. Gonna lock him in. We'll finish. Yep. Oh, that was too slow. Like, the bus had the right idea, but he just reacted way too slow. He knows that his time is coming. He just needs to find his one window of opportunity and the bus continues to short Oh, like, he tried to, he tried to hit him with the, with the wave star. Luto is just popping off. All right, back to battlefield. takes a forward air for Rosalina and still is in play. Gluto's doing a really good job of like avoiding the buzz kill confirm. Like he keeps jumping over what the buzz is doing and back airing him. As the red applying pressure just with movement. And the downer once again being a much better two frame tool than forward tell at this point because it's oh, a bit closer to him. Yeah, got him by Luma. Barry's gonna kill. Him. Yep, there it is. Is that so far? And Gluto, I think. I think of Omar Wario, I don't think it's bad. I think he lived that well. I think, um, like, the buzz going Omar against Glutiny would just be for matchup unfamiliarity. Missed that, yeah. Gluto is, like, really hoping he get that. Wow, that's so unfortunate. Oh, he died, wow. I was gonna say, although to be fair, Glutiny didn't need to use Waft game two. He, like, he beat uh, the Buzz completely Waftless. Again, Gluto has to work extra hard. Thankfully, though, he can run the clock if he wants to. He can get another Waft charged, but it's going to take a while, and you might take a lot of percent because of it. The downer does not hit the Buzz this time around, and once again hits a Luma. Yeah, Luma. What? Okay, I guess he didn't have his bike. Oh, back to Battlefield, wow. So I guess they both really like this stage. Trapping Gluto's landing over and over, and he's just getting so many miles, so much mileage. Do we see the Nair? Why did that almost combo? That looked like it was almost a confirm. Rose's Nair is like so good. Now here is the puppet master of the buzz, but just full hopping right over, but recalling the. Yeah, it feels like every time Gluttony hits hits uh oh okay got those half there, but every time Gluttony hits hits Luma, the buzz keeps trying to up smash, even though Luma's like in hit stun. 
get these kinds of hits, right? The confirm with a down zone to dash attack, or perhaps a back here once they are right here. And take there it we there. go. That, that Luma would have interrupted if Ludo went for an additional. Wow, that's so funny. The closing out the stock, the second stock for the buzz here in game number four. Oh, that would have been disgusting if you got so that last so up here. Easily, just already showing that Nair into up air so high up can take a stock. And speaking of high up, I the buzz's Luma management is disgusting. Like the way he moves Luma around to avoid getting hit was actually amazing. Oh, he did the thing when he messed up, but he got the down smash. Yeah, dude, the buzz has truly leveled up his Luma play. It looks like, like. The way he's he's controlling Luma is just it's not even a level above the other Rosa players, it's like three levels above them. Like he's just he is the puppet master. Oh Luma saved him. Luma saved him. That's not it just yet. Almost. Oh, that's gonna do it. Yep. Got got with the Luma there. That was so smart too. Like the buzz recognizing like how Blutony was going to act defensively. I feel like whoever wins this, there's gonna be a very big pop off. Very true, and the Lumas have been the MVP of this. Dude, uh, right. Rosalia's damage output's actually like it's it's good. She has that Nair kill confirm. She's got that wave shine nonsense. In no rush to approach the buzz. I like how Lutini's playing. He's playing so patient because he knows that pretty much the buzz can confirm a kill like pretty soon. That's a fantastic. I mean, we were talking about speed building house. The buzz Ooh, misses the up smash. Pretty much, yeah. He sets up shop. He sets up home. That's something else I've noticed about the buzz. He's been like very liberal with his up smash usage. The, he, that was that was that was it. Oh my! Like I said, he's been very liberal liberal with his up smash usage. He's kind of just like throwing it out sometimes. It feels like. If he does go for another half lob, it'll probably be after. Okay, yeah, now nah, that up smash made sense. He actually covered everything. There is literally nowhere that uh, Glutiny could have gone. That was like very well spaced. Remember, the buzz is past the same amount of socks, of course, but Ludo, look at these percent comparison to the buzz. He doesn't have waft, does he? Oh, Luma coming in clutch! I, I don't even know if he had waft or not, but if he did, he was. He, I'm pretty sure he was dead. Okay, but Ludo yeah, we're definitely. Buzz on. definitely gonna start spamming up Smash just a little bit, again. But another down air from Luma. Oh, that was smart from Bluto. There it is. There's the up smash. Once again, he's like, he's not afraid to throw it out. Okay, but this is still scary. Like, Lutini can just confirm loss on last stop. So that you can actually set up for it. Because the moment you forget about Luma, he's very patient from the buzz. He knows that Lutini doesn't want the grab. He wants to confirm into like a strong hit. And he'll shield because of that. Order of operations, friends. Pretty much. But Ludo's clearly. Not okay, that's not gonna kill. I mean, he, he's throwing out amazing. The buzz is gonna look for an up smash. He's gonna look for it. The, okay, got gets down smash. I feel like that was up smash. Who was up O up two O at the beginning of this? There it is. Yeah, yeah he's throwing it out. From the buzz against. He got it. Oh, there it is. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> All right. He definitely said something. I don't know what he said. <laughs> what, was, what was that? He like went crazy for a moment and then he kind of calmed down and he's like, yeah, I did that. <laughs> what? Because <laughs> I'm the king of New York. Can you imagine he said that? That would be amazing. The last time that the Buzz and Sonic played was at Double Down. Yeah, the Buzz one. All right. I feel like it's going to be a long set too. Bluto switched off of, off of Wario. He switched off of Wario against Sonic's. Oh, Roy. Ooh, the upper kill. Yeah, though I think that the bus has built a comfortable enough lead so that he doesn't have to have, he doesn't actually have to worry about the presence of the Oh and Sonic Wow What? I was surprised Sonic's went for that. That just seemed like such a huge gamble with, with how like homing attack works. For a little bit at 44% is starting to get heavier and it and it just might if uh, the bus hey, gets the good use of that next look. The thing about it is, like, I feel like even though Sonic kills Luma, he doesn't play aggressively enough normally to, like, capitalize on it as much as he would be able to. Your attention to the timer. One minute and 49 seconds. Right now, lasting. If Sonic takes this stock away from the buzz... Okay, kill Luma again, though. 
Rosonix makes a mistake on his approach, and Debus is able to kill him for it. Yeah, why not take it? Wow, okay, okay. back in it. By that board mask, things were looking very scary for the Dominican Republic. So many things coming his way. That's one okay, it's nice. Gets the, the Nair up here confirmed, which seems so consistent. The buzz gets that so much. Finds that back throw fair. Okay. Backing up some 4% here is Sonics, and that platform was looking a little scary. That for a almost was a Huge kill. heritage from the by those interactions that I'm <laughs> calling moves the wrong names. Sonics, though, he's not giving DeBuzz much of a break here on Town and City, especially with the platform layout. And the crowd is betting on which color Luma yep. is going to come. The bus and the same setup that was so deadly before for the bus, it's not working out anymore. But this just Ooh. might end the board smash. Even though he had to trade out the Luma, the bus very aggressive of stage as well. He is. How many? Luma? I do. I don't know. Yeah, the buzz has lost so many Lumas against Sonics. I think Sonics has killed Luma more than anyone. Color once again. What's the point <laughs> of that? Does not want to take part. Sonic needs no partner in crime other than his own oh, two fear. Yeah, that that is all that he Ooh, needs. Yeah, you're dead. Oh, that's so strong. Actually, if Luma hits, and a good note platform can do something, and this next layout could also end up dead. Yeah, and that. Real yeah, town city. That is getting very scary. It's looking like an even set at this point. If Sonic is just able to give himself up, this crowd is definitely going crazy for this Luma's right here. No He's way! That's a line. thing! Oh, that's Jesus a Christ! Dude, Nair is messed up. Bring to avoid any sort of situation uh, from the bus, but he's still on the prowl. The Luma oh, though, didn't hit, and it will even disappear. Sonics. Oh, he's dead. Just yeah, that's gonna here, do it. He will get the the Sonic classic. The yeah, dude, that Nair is is actually insane. <laughs> the confirm was actually nuts. You right in all battlefield here for the bus and opening up strong is Sonics. He will get rid of that Luma immediately. It didn't. The bus letting rip that Optimus, but no home. Yeah, dude. That Sonic's is, every time, every time he just kills Luma. Deadly the bus can be after hitting. He, he just makes sure that Luma's dead. But he really hasn't hit much of anything yet on this stock. Finally, he almost got it again. Looking to get a little bit of a repeat. What happened? It's almost perfectly even as Luma goes down once more. Sonic's though. Ooh, that killed. I feel like that was bad the eye on Sonic's part. He went straight up. Every single hit is enough for DeBuzz. When he's got this stock lead, he's only playing for extra credit. He's only playing to widen that gap between Ooh, himself yeah. and Sonic. But not just sure the cross that. up. I'm in time again. We've seen DeBuzz, though, working with those aerials, even trying to catch the cross up, which not many characters can actually do. Oh, the Hummer oh, deck looking very scary as well. That is sort of stump from Luma. Two frame dare is gonna kill. Yeah, Luma's dare is so good at two frame. I mean, so is Rose's, but I mean, at the end, both of them are two frame. Surprisingly, ding the buzz recover that high against him. I was terrified that that's actually what we were going to be seeing, but it's not come to pass. And the buzz still holding on to this second stock. Oh. Confirm right These there. nares from the buzz are like the, still the MVP of this set. This oh, my, that could have been it. Yeah, the, the, the buzz is getting so the much off of there. Plan here, and he will get the bounce to the other side. It's like the buzz just playing his advantage. Marbles. They're going to try and get the Probably little rapid it. jab on the ledge there, but that barely missed. The, the buzz will catch a little bit sooner than he would have killed. But it's not quite enough to do it. Looking for another two. Oh, the launch star is straight. That was it. That was game. You could have killed him. Knows he doesn't have to actually commit to getting the ledge strap right and the back throw. The Luma oh, is for Luma. That is one of the shortest lifespans that I've ever seen. That was actually a good recovery from the bars. This world almost like really he was too low to, to make it with the uh, with the up but he got hit by the spring and text. Glutiny levels of survivability in this second stock against Sonic says that's again. it. Dude, that Nair! That Nair's so good! I feel like Rosa's Nair is legit pre-patch Ike Nair. That's what it looks like. Look at this! <laughs> this hitbox! Dude, it hits in front of her twice! And it's minus four! Very wisely not landing on that platform, not trying to contest Sonic. Wow, that was so good. Yeah. Um, it makes sense because Sonic is like so worried about getting hit with an air confirm that the buzz like, okay, you're in an air dodge here because you're wor you're worried about getting hit with an up air or something. Trying to spin back in out of the corner, but oh, he tried to hit him with the wave shine. 
another F Smash connects. This is one of the few to this caliber. Now he's got Sonics going high. He's looking for something. We're getting the rapid jab on the ledge as well to send Sonics okay, off. Okay, this is looking pretty dumb. Go up three stocks to one. The boss has how did the buzz do that with Luna? Like, how did oh miss? Get to the Luma will but the way it. like Luma was like pulling is pulling right out or coming back to him was so weird. You do not give the buzz enough time to waste before the Luma does Yo, jump Yeah, this is over. This is gonna be so incredibly hard to even with Sonic and his patience. Like the buzz is playing too too well right now. Sometimes so the ultra is very effective at that point and the takes the first stock finally. The other thing is too, like so, like the buzz can play for time if he wants to. Like the buzz is not like is not opposed to timing him out. Because of it, as Black Luma comes out and the crowd goes wild. Wait a minute, oh, Sonic has not gotten touched. Okay, as I said, he gets it. He found out. He, he messed around and he found out what happens when you try and run in on Sonic's in that spot. There, he's not going to make the same mistake twice. Okay, he is going he's to get living. By that back air, and while he's gonna get edge guarded. Nope. Oh, wait a minute. Just like that. So Sonic definitely has a huge hurdle ahead of him here in what might just be his last stop. Entirely possible that it is tuned as the buzz connects with the fair by the ledge. Luma has to be sacrificed for it. Grab up smash. Oh no, just grab strap. fourth row. Get him off stage. Luma should be coming back soon. What he needs to do. Luma is there it is. Benefit, not a necessity as he continues to keep Sonic's trapped here. Oh, that's it. That should be and it. The rapid jab yeah. Going to the buzz. I don't know, what was that head shake? The buzz like, I should, should have been that close, no. <laughs> the buzz wanted to time out. <laughs> no.